Well, the weekend is only minutes away, and if you're stuck wondering, what in the world am I going to do with my time off? Well, WDEF News host Tobias Parrish has an option for you that's truly out of this world. Follow this week's edition of the Scenic City Scene. This week, the scene transports you to another world for a preview of the Kanuga comic, sci-fi, and horror convention through the mind's eye of author Ed Crandall. Ed is the author of the epic science fiction series Westworld. And Crandall spins his tales of a futuristic frontier culture locked in an epic struggle and a quest for power and ultimately survival. Taking a cue from the great George Lucas, Ed has created not just characters in a story, but an entire universe. It's kind of interesting because I use real world history to kind of flesh it out, but then use my imagination to create the, the history and the vehicles and culture and technology that, that they use. So it's half imagination, part real history. And imagination is still the biggest part of Crandall's work. He's given folklore and customs to the history of cultures that exist only in his story. Even though I have otherworldly characters, uh, human characters, alien characters, trying to make these characters believable, relatable to the reader. Westworld is the story of a young military officer named Tom Shallowhorn, who finds himself conflicted by the orders he is supposed to carry out. Crandall's hero travels to a far and away world and is saddled with the task of wiping out an indigenous people for the sake of mining a precious ore. After killing his commanding officer, Shallowhorn goes on the run as a fugitive, and here is where Westworld's story really begins. But the story isn't just killing and conquest. His characters learn there are all too real consequences for every action. This adventure also has a message. Originally, the idea came from seeing veterans from war that come home. Uh, so many times they're troubled by the things that they've done, even though they think they've done them for a good cause. Westworld as a story has a little bit of everything. Action, adventure, science fiction. But Crandall's characters are flawed, and they lend a taste of relativity to his audience. Ed takes his literary inspiration from George Lucas, as well as the narratives of James A. Michener. He will promote and sign his books, Westworld and Return to Westworld, at the Conuga Convention this weekend. Also, readers should be on the lookout for the final installment, The Battle for Westworld. For WDF News 12 Scenic City Scene, I'm Tobias Parrish. You can purchase a copy of Ed Crandall's book, Westworld, by going to Conuga this weekend. Conuga will run from Friday evening until Sunday afternoon at the Chattanooga Trade and Convention Center. You can also order Westworld by going to the website at www.westworld.mysite.com. So check that out if you get a chance.